Third deed of a man is what? Well, oh Jesus. Now, let me explain this. Remember that this is because of research and biblical principles. The male was designed by God to be motivated by his eyes. A woman is motivated by her ear. Two different creatures. Remember, she's emotional, he is logical. So a man is stimulated by what he sees. A woman by what she hears. When a man sees a woman, it impacts him. When a woman hears a man, it impacts her. Two different creatures. So because of that, a male has a natural desire to look for beauty. Secondly, because he's, a, he's aggressive, he has a natural desire to want to protect what is his. So this, this combination produces a spirit of a desire for an attractive wife. He wants something that is beautiful and something that is worth protecting. He doesn't want an attractive wife. He needs it. Now remember Jesus Christ is representing the male and the church represents the wife. Huh? If you study, you study it again in the book of Ephesians 5, it says what? Husband, love your wife like Christ loved the church. What does he do? He cleanses her, washes her, takes away spot, takes every wrinkle, every blemish. Right? And he presents her to who? Himself. Not to the father, himself. Why? He wants to be proud of his wife. All of you all talk often about this Proverbs 31 woman. Now my wife and I are going to be writing a book next year. Both of us write this book. The book will be titled, The Proverbs 31 Man. You need to study that man. That is also about that man. And if you study that woman, she understood that man. It says that she dressed in tapestry and fine. You know, I mean, she, was, she, she knows how to put herself together. He was proud to sit in the gate of judgment. In other words, he went to work bragging and said, that's my wife, man. Look at that woman. Woo, that's my wife. He was proud to take her out in the public. Some men hide their wives. Stay home, baby. Stay home. Stay home. Stay home. Pray at home. A man needs an attractive wife. So he can present her to himself. So ladies, it's not for pressure. If you know that he needs that, then supply that need. Look good all the time. If you wear rollers in your hair, let your rollers look dignified. <laughs> I'm serious about this. I've seen women, man, God have mercy. They go out to you know, go to the store, slippers, dirty clothes, hair and rollers, praise the Lord. <laughs> They don't even walk with dignity, you know? <laughs> Fella comes home from a hard day's work, wife opens the door, <laughs> and he... <laughs> she got frying pan in the hand, knife in one, <laughs> grease all over her hair. <laughs> Welcome home, baby! Attractive wife. <laughs> you know what the Bible says? Listen, you know, you know what the Bible says? Uh, are we okay? Is everybody okay? Can I go a little bit, long, little bit longer? Okay. Listen, watch this. In the book of Genesis, very interesting. It says about a woman and a man. It says, For this cause should a man leave his mother and father and cling to his wife. Now, the word cling there, when I studied it, it blessed me. The word cling is the Hebrew word which means to chase after. Now, this is very interesting. The Bible says, for this cause should a man leave his mother and father and chase after his wife. Now, 
it says chase your wife now normally you chase the woman you want to marry don't you guys you chase her and when you catch her you stop running why she stopped that's the problem she used to dress up before you got married she always smelled good before you got married she put on her best that's why you wanted to be around her you couldn't be without her you chased her and then when you caught her she stopped doing what made you chase her my wife is a smart woman I'm going to talk about mine. I, I, I know mine, so I talk about mine all the time. My wife looks better now than before we got married. I mean, there ain't no hope for me. <laughs> I wake up, I want to chase her. I chase her around the house all the time. Come here, girl. <laughs> You're supposed to look better after you get married. Fix yourself better after you get married. Look better, dress better, smell better. I mean, make, he, make him look at no one but you. But most women, child, I done got him. What are I going to go diet for? I already got him. What are I got to go do with all this stuff? I Just as I am. <laughs> And you're wondering why the guy is coming home late. Because the view is not too interesting. Have mercy.